This is Captain Joe Kent with this week's GoBaha.com fishing report. Well, we're getting pretty close to April. We've got another week left before the uh, month of March ends and April begins. April is one of the big transition months down here. It's when the shrimp start migrating back into the bays and along with them lots of other fish. We're seeing shrimp boats out working not too far from the surf and that's a clear sign that the shrimp are moving back in. Now what does that mean? That means that the gaff top, trout, reds, of course the reds and trout are, are year-round inhabitants of the bay, but we're going to have a lot of other fish coming in too. The summertime fish like the Spanish mackerel, that water is going to have to get a little bit warmer before they start coming in, but they're going to be following the bait fish. Shrimp migration is the key to starting the fishing season for the summer. Also the water temperature, the beach water, breachfront water temperature has surpassed the magic 70 degree mark and that's a sign that things are going to just bust open any day. Now when temperature gets into around the mid 70s range that's when we really start seeing the fish come in. Now I think in the bays we're going to start seeing a lot of good action too on a multitude of other fish coming in. You're going to have other fish besides, I mean, other uh, schools of trout and reds coming in to feed. And so look for some action to really get good here in about two to three weeks. Still, we've got some excellent fishing for the big black drum. They're just all over. They're down, down from the uh, Keybrook, Kima Seabrook Channel where just last week a nice sized 50 pounder was caught. We're catching them all over. Down around the mouth is Dickinson Bio, the Texas City Dyke, Moses out the mouth of Moses Lake. They're just, uh, if you're really interested in some good action on some big fish, the black drum are there running now, and they probably will be for about two to three more weeks. After that, that's when we're going to start getting a variety of other fish. And it's the time to get your fishing tackle geared up to get out and do some fishing. And remember, the best time to go fishing is whenever you can. This is Captain Joe Kent, and we'll be back again next week.